Set for a start. Flag goes up from behind, 1,600 metres to race. Jets are back. They're off and racing from that 1,600 metre mark. And maybe Metal is seen by design just to tuck out and race from the back end of the field. Strawberry Light from the inside gate responded well, but time flies on the outside. Is on the improved to go up and set out the pace. And has set the fractions, goes out to the front and leads the way by one length. Strawberry Light battle on the inside rail in second. Then comes Fleeting in the one-out position, racing three lengths off the early leader in third. Further back to Green Grow the Lilacs, who's joined alongside Totally Rocks. Further back, two lengths and running to Betty Boop, who's alongside Symphony of Light. And Metar with the black cap is last of all as they're about to reach the crossover with just on 1,000 meters left to race. Out in front as time flies, shows the way by one and a half lengths. Fleeting on the outside is right up there alongside Strawberry Light as they battle it out for second and third. Further half a length back to Totally Rocks with the cheek pieces, who's racing on the outside of Green Grow the Lilacs. Then comes Symphony of Light and Betty Boop. Last of all, Metar as they're about to make their run for the judge, with just about 700 metres left to go. Out in front is Time Flies, going to try and go from barrier to box, has the lead by two lengths. Further back and running, we've got Fleeting as well as Strawberry Light. Then comes Green Grow the Lilac, racing alongside Totally Rot, deeper out on the track to Symphony of Light and Meta. Betty Boop, last of all, as they're into the final 500 meters. Time Flies has decided to go towards the inside for a run. The cheat pieces still has the lead by one length. Strawberry Light is also traveling quite well at this stage. Green Grow the Lilacs along the inside, and Betty Boop is also starting to creep a little bit closer deeper out. We've got Meta as they're into the final 200 meters. Now it's Time Flies and Strawberry Light, but Time Flies still has a half a length to spare. Strawberry Light trying to fight back. Betty Boop is also starting to run him smartly, but it's number seven Time Flies who's now kicked clear, and number seven Time Flies is going to win from Betty Boop. Then came Strawberry Light for Followed by Meta, Green Grow the Lilacs further back in running, then Totally Rocks. Seems to be a good day here for the Brett Crawford as well as the Luan Kotwa team here. And they have a treble on the day. Number seven, Time Flies, the four-year-old Bay Dynasty filly, is now a four-time winner from eight starts. Kits clear into the closing stages and is going to reward the Ridgemont team here as well as the Hollywood Bet Syndicate nominee, Mr. Anthony Dalpish. Number seven, Time Flies, the winner for race number six. Into second. Number five, Betty Boop, who came from a long way back and ran on quite well, followed by number one, Strawberry Light, into third. Then, come num then came number eight, Meta into fourth, followed by Green Grow the Lilacs, Fleeting and Totally Rocks, and then Symphony of Light. Number seven, Time Flies, went straight to the front and stayed there for the duration of the race, went towards the inside of the track, that's where most of the runners have been winning the races today, just gathering the reins, Louis Mkotwa, Richard Faree trying to battle it out since the closing stages, but Louis yet to have used the stick now, guides into the right direction, the cheat pieces, the Hollywood bet salts, the green cap, and just gets punched out in the closing stages, and number seven, Time Flies, wins again.